Yellow duckies and welcome to a Song of the Prairie. This is a demo I found and it reminded me a lot visually of like Harvest Moon, Story of Seasons, uh, Rune Factory, those kinds of games. And I just thought that looks absolutely adorable. I want to play that. So yeah, let's get into it with a new game. Green. <sighs> what? Okay. I seem to have slept for a long time. What? Is it you who Did you disturb my dream? Mm. Eh, aren't you the legendary ghost who saved the world? You are the legendary ghost who saved the world. 你拥有传奇的身份，强大的力量，强大的力量，强大的力量，强大的力量，强大的力量，强大的力量，强大的力量，强大的力量，强大的力量，强大的力量，强大的力量，强大的力量，强大的力量，强大的力量，强大的力量
Oh. Can't do Winnie. Winnie is not open for the... I guess it's Kelly or Burgess, and I... I don't know if the sound is actually as, as loud to you guys as it is to me. Like, I can't tell. <laughs> so, either way. Um, I think we'll go with Kelly. Ah, we can- I, okay, good, 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 good. Because I was about to say, like, that is not my hair. that look but I kind of prefer this and as far as highlights we're gonna go a little bit more this is what I may actually go for my actual hair color Hips. It's interesting, the eyebrows change the eye shape and design the eyelashes. I'm gonna stick with that. Oh wow, I love the transition from the character creation, like the, the, the shadowing and everything, it's nice. Congratulations on becoming the new owner of the farm. In order to welcome you, the mayor's been waiting for you at the farm. See the bus stop ahead? That's the convenient transport for, for our town. Residents of the town can use it for free. Be quick, let's use it to the, mm, to the farm now. Down 
town became prosperous, maybe they wouldn't leave here. Let's go to the farm first. Maybe. Oh, this is the best spot. Okay. Oh. Piggy Express. Farm station. Okay. <laughs> Piggy. This is your farm. How's it going? Isn't it good? Although it looks a little deserted now, I believe that as long as you take good care of it, it will soon come back to life. The mayor should be taking care of wheat at the gate of the farm cab. Let's go and find him. Oh my gosh. He fell asleep watering the plants. And unexpectedly he fell asleep again. He clearly said to make a good impression on the new Kimmer. Viola, please forgive him. The mayor hasn't had a good sleep in a long time for the farm. Let's be a little considerate to him. Thank you. You are really a reasonable person. I think the mayor will wake up later. Oh. oh my god, Wallace. What would you bring? Why don't you wake, wake me up? Mayor, this is our newcomer in the farm, Viola. She's a gentle and considerate person. She told me not to disturb you. Am I right? Anyway, it's rude to be so rude to the newcomer. Hello, young- wait. I'm not a man. I'm Mayor Hart here. The young people in the town like to call me Uncle Hart. You can do the same if you don't mind. As newcomer, you must have a lot of problems. I wonder if you're interested in listening to me briefly introduce the town. Sure, tell me. I knew no one could resist the curiosity about the town. Legends of, of goddess spread here once attracted many people. So do do excuse the the wording and the phrasing. I, I believe the game was originally uh, developed in Chinese, so it's kind of a translation situation. So. That was a legend a long time ago, Wallace. Now, the most important thing in our town is the quiet and rich pastoral life. But for today's young people, this may be unattractive. Mayor, what are you talking about in front of our new people? There is no place more charming than this land. I believe Viola will fall in love with it immediately. You're still the same. You're full of fighting spirit when you hear the bad words of the town. This is also your advantage. Viola, Wallace is looking forward to you. Mayor, don't stick to these unimportant things. Don't you see that our Viola is a little tired? Aren't you lost again? Took our newcomer around the town. It was a year ago. No, no I, I won't get lost. It was just sightseeing. Don't be shy. There's some lovely shortcomings that will make the make you more charming. I I get what they're trying to say, but it's just tripping me up a little. By the way, the cabin in the back is your new home. We have cleaned it for you. When you have time, you can slowly decorate it as you like. And I will be a guest at that time. Okay. This may be your first time living on a farm, but don't worry, life starts from scratch and has fun growing up. Seeing you is like seeing myself. It reminds me of the, those lost youth. I once worked on a farm and won the first prize in the best farming posture competition in the town. Like this! Oh good! wind is noisy today. I want to breathe fresh air above my head. <laughs> well, it's almost time. I have to go, go back to the guild to deal with the rest of the work. As for our newcomer, I'll leave it to you to teach her how to work on the farm.
is our interact. Okay. All right. I didn't expect the mayor to reveal his biggest secret so quickly. He wanted to make a good impression on you. He must be depressed. I'll send him his hat when I'm free. But I better teach you how to farm now. Please. Don't worry. I'll teach you hand to hand to make you a qualified farmer. This is a hoe for you. Let's start with hoeing. But my field's already... Oh, this one. Okay. Oh yes, I'll teach you by doing it myself. Did you see my demonstration just now? You can reclaim the uncultivated land by using a hoe. The rest is dep depend on you. Give it a try. Good job. You have successfully reclaimed this land. And we are one step closer to our goal. Now let's sow on the re un the reclaimed land. Try this bag of radish seeds. Okay. One thing is essential for these seeds to thrive. I'm sure you've guessed it. Now switch the tool to the newly obtained kettle and water the sown land. Okay, see. As before, I'll demonstrate it first. Fail to pay attention and watch me. When the seeds absorb enough water, they will begin to grow. Soil blocks that have been watered will become darker. There is no need to water them today. Seeds will grow rapidly only when they are full of water. Next, try for yourself. Mm. Got some special ones, it looks like. You're more talented than I thought. Maybe you will become a planting expert in the future. Don't forget to water those radishes every day so you can harvest them in a few days. See the box at the door? At five o'clock every afternoon, someone will come to collect the goods. You just put the things you need to sell into the box and you can get paid the next day. water the soon land every day. Different crops need different growth times. When they mature, they'll become harvestable. Put the crops in the, in before 5 p.m. each day and receive payment the next morning. These are the small gifts given to you by the mayor. He hopes you can take good care of the farm in the future. In order to help you get familiar with the farm life as soon as possible, the mayor prepared a journal for you and left some simple tasks in the memo. Open it and have a look. T to open the book. Okay. Harvest 30 crops and ship 50 crops. These are simple tasks. I believe you will complete them soon. 
At the gate of town, there's a grocery store called Anti Open Shop. You can buy seeds of all seasons there. Lori, the boss of the grocery store, has always been curious about you. Go and say hello to her. I can show you the way. Uh, why not take a stroll around myself? Well, don't forget to come when you're free. I wish you a happy life on the farm and regard it as your home. I tried all kinds of methods. It seems the house can't be repaired. Unfortunately, this house is one of the most advanced buildings in this town. A suspicious name? What? I'm not a suspicious person. I'm Amanda, who does good deeds everywhere to help people repair their homes. I usually go to repair the broken house and give it to people for free after repairs, mainly to help some poor people. Unfortunately, Unfortunately, this house is so damaged that it can't be repaired. The fancy house... Hmm. Say, guys? I got up early this morning. <laughs> uh, otherwise, it can only be demolished. Otherwise, it can be taken to many people. I think you're a new person to move into the small house over there. Let me remind you that your house can be upgraded. Hand in the materials at the brand. Someone will help you upgrade your house. The structure of your house will not break, so you can upgrade boldly. And since the house, well, since the house can't be repaired, I should leave and look for the next house. Bye. Closure. Hello. You wait a minute. Don't say it. Oh. Let me reason it. Smart and elegant hairstyle, wise and firm eyes, plus the wheat fragments on your feet. Ah, I see. Are you the illegitimate son of the mayor who's been separated for many years? I'm not a son of anyone. You've been wandering for many years without a basis. After all the hardships, you finally found that irresponsible failure would... No. It's reaction. I'm right. Are you guilty? Ah, uh, wrong reasoning. When can I reach the level of my idol? I think again. According to my survey, the only people who have planted wheat in the farm recently are Uncle Hart and... Are you the newcomer to the farm? Sorry, I forgot you. 
My name is Abby. I'm a woodcutter in town. However, I have another agency. That is detective! Although I still have some deficiencies in reasoning, one day I will become a very popular detective. What you lack is more than reasoning. Huh? What else do I lack? I see. It's an assistant. Every detective must have an assistant around him. Just in time, you come and be my assistant. Dear assistant, now I want to reason again. Let me guess. No, it's another reasoning. What do you want to do most now? Hmm, I see. It's logging! How on earth do you reason? Hey, it's a secret. If you want to know the answer, exchange it with me with other secrets. Now, let me teach you how to log wood. I'm very good at it. Seeing that you're empty-handed, I'll give you my spare axe first. Yay! However, it is suggested that you want to be a woodcutter. You should go to the blacksmith's shop and make an axe more suitable for yourself. Okay. No, I can't spend all of my money yet. The bridge is out. Death mine? I, I, I'm kind of scared. Why is there a death mine? Should I be afraid of the death mine? That sounds kind of deadly. Death mine. Never stop fishing without winning that Lindy. Don't stop. Okay. 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 Oh, hey. Animals in the wild at home can be touched. After touching small animals will follow you until you touch the next small animal or the next. Okay. But. What about these? Can I water these? Hmm. Goo goo. It's a goo goo. Go over here to the rock pile, meet this person. Hello. Please don't call me him again. Hmm. Are you here for that too? Do I have to be so clear? You also heard the woodcutter's rumor and came to blackmail me, didn't you? As long as you get, get close to me, you will encounter misfortune. Sometimes you will be knocked unconscious by broken ore. Sometimes she will fall into a pit dug at an unknown time. I've seen a lot of people like you extorting medical expenses from me. I thought this was a place free from mortally strife. 
So I decided to spend the rest of my life here. Now I find that there are still too many opportunistic people. Uh, hold up. Now what? I told you so much out of kindness. Don't think you can get close to me. Oh, it's you. I was preconceived just now. I'm sorry. My name is Clock. I'm a miner in town. Mayor mentioned you to me. He gave, he told me to give you this hammer. You can use it to mine. You can also go to the death mine in town and trust me with mining. This is my job and I won't refuse. Nothing else I left. Okay. That's just as mine. Here's the piggy thing. Here's the piggy thing. I didn't necessarily want to pick up the twig, but okay. We're going to town. Come back out and figure this out. In a bit. Lots of petals, lots of flowers. I leveled up by picking stuff. petals are good for something or if I'm just picking things random. I mean it seems like I can get XP for picking things at random so might as well. I get into what do you mean you look down on red please don't let me repeat it I'm just talking to you and breathing there you breathe is a blasphemy against fashion talking to someone who doesn't know fashion like you is like casting pearls before swine you look rural all over. No, she doesn't. If I were your guest, I would be ashamed of my choice. Do you want to fight? Hmm, what a savage. Look at yourself. Your fashion is to dress up as a colorful beetle. Beetle? What are you talking about? Wait, someone's coming. Great. 
I don't judge. Hmm. Uh... Hey, you're here just in time. My name is Tuya. I am a tailor in town. I think red is, an, is the incomparable color in the world. I believe you think so too. Don't listen to her nonsense. The essence of fashion is the collision and complementarity of different colors. My name is Caro. I'm a barber in town or a hairstylist. I study in the city of art for log type. Come on, I have studied in the country of art. How many times do you have to repeat the sentence? I'm just telling the truth. Does it hurt your heart? Come on, I don't care. I believe this passerby can make a correct judgment. Who looks better, me or him? <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> don't mock me. Same to you, flower parrot. Stop giving me a nickname. If you want to be more fashionable, I can help you change your hairstyle. I promise it won't. I want your clothes. Cra my crafter will let you down. <laughs> Thank gosh. Time is urgent. Just say it. Oh. gosh. N no. No. Give it back. Ah. Now I'm kind of frustrated took all my money just because he's wanted to give me a new haircut. Hello. Okay. Who am I talking to now? Muttering. Is the boss there? I have known to refuse others since I was a child because the best way to protect my art is to refuse others first. I haven't said what to do yet. Every stone has a past. Even the e uneven stone now has a smooth past. Can you two listen to me? Two? Can you see me? Uh, isn't it normal to see you? I'm very sorry. I didn't expect anyone to notice me so soon. Because I have a low sense of existence since I was a child, it's usually, usually difficult for someone to find my existence. Especially when there is someone beside me. I'm really sorry to say so much in one, at one breath. I should introduce myself this time. My name is Pauline. My brother Power is talking to himself. He is immersed in his own art world. If the meeting between us is accidental, is the ending between us really inevitable? Once my brother enters status, it, that's it. It's hard to interrupt him at this time. This is the creation workshop. My brother Power is responsible for building various facilities and I will sell some furniture. I'm um, very sorry to tell you so much again. As you can see, my brother can't deal with people now. Please come back later. Perfect art. Don't you think so, Pauline? Pauline? Pauline, where are you? Oh my gosh. 
take a look at the furniture here. Um, actually, were you the one that wanted? Oh, you want hardwood. Okay. Here we go. Oh, this is our house. Not our store. The store is here. Um, hello? There's nobody here? treasure chest. Oh. What did I just do? Sun is warm. I really want to go back to sleep. By the way, I heard that new people came to the farm today. Wallace must be busy teaching her. What are you doing standing there quietly? Oh, you're a new sister from the farm. My name is Lori. I'm the boss of this don't want to open grocery store. In the future, your farm can't live without me. We get along well. So, do you believe in telepathy? In fact, just now I was wondering who you were. Unexpectedly, you appeared. Is it because you heard my voice? I'm kidding. By the way, I also prepared a gift for you. This comfortable chair was made by Pauline from the Creation Workshop. It's the same as mine. If you are, if you is tired, if you are tired while working on the farm, just sit in a chair and recover. With this one, wrench, you can fold up the chair. Take my gift, and you will be my sister. I actually have something to trouble you. Did you see the broken station at the gate of town? Since it's broken down, people will have to walk to the farm. Brother Power says that it needs a lot of wood and stone to repair it. It's too troublesome for me. Can you help me repair it? When the station is repaired, it will be more convenient for Sister Viola to come to me later. statue. Okay. Ah, I can jump. Blacksmith. What's the task? New people is nothing to do with me. If you don't need, need me, leave quickly. Wait, what's your name? Sakona. Okay, not that friendly, are you? Hey, you. Who allowed you to enter the blacksmith shop without permission? It seems you were driven out by the goddess, too. I haven't seen you. You shouldn't be a member of the goddess support associate. According to the process, you should first become a member of the goddess support committee, then rely on the queue to decide the time to talk to the goddess. Because the goddess doesn't like others to disturb her. Generally speaking, only a few people can talk to the goddess a month. Then the confessed gifts and love letters were thrown into the stove, and the confessors were driven out by the goddess. What? Well, after all, she is the untouchable goddess. Only with such indifference, such high cold, and such beauty can she deserve the title of her goddess. When I first met her, I fell in love with her. I was driven out by her without even asking her name didn't know her name until I joined the Goddess Support Association. There are people like me in the Goddess Support Association. I think you are also one of them. 
I might as well join the Goddess Support Association first and start from knowing the name of the goddess. I already know the name. Beg your pardon? That's impossible. You already know the name of the goddess? It's impossible to say that the goddess has favored you. Okay. Well. Herman. Who is Herman? Little kitty over here. Come on, come closer. Don't worry, I'm not a strange. Huh? Like Lori said, you're an interest you really are an interesting child. By the way, my name is Jiu. I'm the Boston Chief Chef of Moon Bay. Though Lori has already told me, you don't mind introducing yourself to me, honey. Fine. Uh, <laughs> this is my gift to you. You really are a uh, uh, roast fish. I'll take it. I like the sister. Such a sweet shot. Something to do. Play with. I sure hope that this translation gets worked on a bit. I'm not a man. I'm even got a female character. <sighs> Wait. Tasks. Lord, cook a dish. Oh, darn it! It's after five. I need to grow more wheat. Then, uh, I need to be able to buy more wheat. Uh, <laughs> Taking these turnips. What about the mushrooms? Can I take the mushrooms? Oyster mushrooms. Yes, I can. Okay. Um, Abby Cabin. day and I haven't even met everybody. This town's huge. Hello? Uh oh. Nobody's here. What? Okay, I activated another pig express. These are people's homes. Restaurant station there. Guess this is the church. No. Somebody named Hart. I can't even get in because the door is broken. Oh wait, Uncle Hart. Hart. Mayor Hart. Yeah. Oh. Fireflies. Surround you and illuminate you. Oh. Hey. Do I know you? Apparently. Hello? I don't know you two. Weeds and fruit here look like pepper. Don't mix them up. Okay. Balance working. Okay. 
You guys don't need to leave the house. I just was trying to get to meet people. the next one and then we'll fast travel home and I think that might be it for at least today's episode. I might do a second episode of this demo just because there's so much to do. Um, So yes, that's going to be it for today's episode. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell icon to keep up to date on all the videos. And remember to free the feral wildflower in you. Bye-bye!